Hi, I'm Ben Thompson. There's some something serious that we have to talk about. Now, first off, I want to say thank you to all those of you who are serving in the armed forces right now, who are striving to preserve the, the freedom as they understand it. What I'm about to say is in no way meant to be disrespectful of anyone in the armed forces. But I believe that if our soldiers are not brought home within the next three years, that it may not, we might not ever see them again. Now, the reason for that is there is a Russian and Chinese alliance that has been created and they have a plan and this is what their plan is China and Russia will launch a high altitude burst of about six nuclear missiles over the continental United States this serves a very useful purpose. A high altitude atomic blast would result in a nuclear electromagnetic pulse, or EMP. And this would have the capacity to destroy all unshielded electronic devices within the continental United States. Now the purpose of this attack will be first to render the infrastructure of the United States useless. Now our government knows that this is going to take place and they have prepared but only for themselves. They have no intention of preparing the American people for this at all. The Chinese and the Russians have for the past few years been updating and constructing new nuclear missile bu uh, bunkers for their citizens but our government is not doing this for us now could we prepare our infrastructure for the CMP blast yes we can but they're not going to do it because they believe it's too expensive and there's probably not enough time to do it now but we know that China and Russia are gearing up for this attack and the EMP blast is just the first part of it six hours later there will be another attack the Chinese and Russian alliance will launch strategic nuclear weapons both from ground-based mobile base and ballistic submarine based nuclear weapons and their purpose will be to strike nuclear uh, the facilities and military bases and other areas of strategic importance now is a nuclear war survivable? Yes. And we will survive. America will be then be invaded, possibly through Mexico. Chinese, Russian, Mexican troops, as well as other nations that have agreed to join in on this attack will be involved. Well, the people who knew about this attack, including the international bankers and the military industrial complex, as well as officials within the government, will be hiding safe in their bunkers in Colorado while this attack takes place. They will lead things from there. They have one purpose. 
mind is to bring down the citizenry of America so that you can bring in a stronger dictatorship within the world. But their plan will backfire to a degree. As Americans clash with the Chinese Russian alliance, the front line of this war inside the United States will be the Rocky Mountains, and out of the West, a new and better America will rise up. The center will be within Nevada and out of the west will rise up another army and it'll take back the land that has been stolen from the Americans. America will rise like a phoenix out of the ashes. America will rise out of the ashes of this war. It will not be a new America. It will be a restoration of the original America that was founded by our founders. More and more Americans are beginning to come to an awareness of the Constitution. We the free citizens of America wish to help in this goal. We are preparing the citizenry of this nation for this war and the, re the, the re restoration of our nation afterwards. America will rise like a phoenix out of the ashes. It will be better and we will be able to take back to a degree of what the international bankers and the military industrial complex has taken. But there's one thing that we need to do. When they come out of their bunkers after the nuclear strikes, we need to let them know that we know that you could have prepared us for this attack. We know that you prepared only for yourselves. We know that you urged them to attack by provoking them. We know that you had the ability to even prevent these missile strikes. But you did not use it because you wished to create a situation where you could bring in a strong dictatorship. I'm Ben Thompson. Please share this message, it's very important. Thank you, and have a good day.